What's up, everybody? It's the Tebbits back with some more Star Wars The Old Republic. Seeing as how today is Revenge of the Sixth, we are going to go ahead and do some flashpoints with one of my Imperial characters. I'm going to log in with Alcindra here. I am currently located on the Imperial fleet and have actually leveled up quite a bit with her. Um, I, I, you know, still have not done any of her story quests. Uh, Every bit of advancement with Alcindra has been through pretty much nothing but flashpoints at this point. Um, but without further ado, I am going to go ahead and queue us up for uh, for some veteran flashpoints. Let's see if we can get into one in a relatively decent amount of time. So every single bit of advancement that I have done with Alcindra is uh, is purely through running these flashpoints. <sighs> okay, so somebody declined. We are going to Aethys. So Aethys was the home of a Sith Lord named Vodal Kresh, and his tomb has been infiltrated, and uh, basically his power has been released. And we're coming here to recover some artifact artifacts. Quick hello to everyone. Repeat, this is Republic Survey Team 689 Mark 1. I don't know who's hearing this. Well, most of us are already dead. Oh, looks like I'm joining another group that's already in progress. Which is fine. Uh oh, I hope I have. Uh -oh. Can I survive if this fall? No, here. <laughs> we'll go ahead and recuperate a little bit before we fall. Alright. Looks like we've got a bounty hunter, another Imperial agent, also a sniper. And possibly a Sith warrior. not a bounty hunter, it's a Sith warrior dressed as a bounty hunter. Let's see if we can sneak through this room here. Mind the alien eggs. <laughs> Somebody's stuck. <laughs> uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh, that was my fault. I got too close. <laughs> Probably gonna die. Uh, probably gonna. Yep, there we go. <laughs> Having the hardest, you know, not the, not the, not the best luck today. Getting through some of these flashpoints. Um, tried to do. Yes. <laughs> Oops. We all kind of made mistakes there. <laughs> some of the most interesting names. Daddy Danglers. <laughs> Ooh, don't go too far. Don't, don't fall too far. I'll let one go. Okay. That's survivable. So you can make that full... You can't fall all the way. Well, maybe you can. I don't know. <laughs> look like they look like they survived. Okay. <laughs> Take three. <laughs> Two, three. I don't know which one we're on. Um, 
we gonna try and sneak through the room again? Yes, we're gonna try and sneak through the room again. As long as we stay far enough away, we're, we're good. If we get too close... I'm I'm stuck. There we go. Can see through there. So these creatures that we're fighting are the result of um, Sith alchemy. And wait, are we engaged in combat somewhere? We are. Uh oh, did not see that. Please come for us. Well, they they try to make converts. They worship some sort of Sith legend. I I have to go. Like somebody was engaged in combat up here, and when I came to try and help, well, looks like I'm probably gonna die <laughs> again. <laughs> yep, there we go. <laughs> I swear somebody was was engaged in some in in a fight in a fight up here, and I was trying to help them out. The Republic sent us to this planet to learn, to see, and we have seen. So much. We hear his voice in our minds. I mean, there's two of us that have died, and I can't. I can't revive. I should be able to revive. I don't know why I can't revive. Let's try this one more time. Somebody got... Somebody left. Let's repair my gear as we're waiting. Grab some Field Fortitude stems. Grab some med packs. Okay. Yeah, we're not. We're not being the most efficient here. I don't know why. You know, seem to be seem to be struggling a little bit today. This is the third or fourth time I've tried to run a flashpoint with Alcindra and each time just keep getting just keep dying like not getting the results that I want like I you know got stuck on uh, the the Kuat drive yards flashpoint and there were so you know we we could not progress past the um, past the main past the final boss. Like we kept uh, kept getting stuck. Like this is not the way we need to go. <clears throat> and now it appears here that you know I'm getting stuck again. This room, I know, you know, like some of these rooms, I, you know, have done this so much that I'm quite familiar with the direction on where to go. Ah. Uh. Oh, come on, I'm getting stuck again. I'm stuck. I am fully stuck. We're trying to bypass a lot of the. Why am I getting stuck here? Uh, 
and I c unfortunately I can't use the stuck command again. 98 seconds. I, I keep getting stuck on this location. I keep getting stuck here. <laughs> I've not had the best day when it comes to, uh, to running these flashpoints. Yeah, so there. I don't know why they put a cooldown timer on the stick command. It's kind of, it's kind of dumb, in my opinion. I keep, you know, like, it's not my fault I got stuck. It's. <laughs> go finally <laughs> that was the that was the hardest thing i don't know why that took so much time why i had such a hard time with that mission a clean up crew no matter you will embrace his word as we did <laughs> That was the most annoying thing. I don't know why I kept getting stuck on the scenery there. He shall rise again, and we will be his favored children. We'll never lay hands on his work. His servants have waited for a thousand years. They will slay you, and return to the stars. Alright, got a device there. That's uh, an earpiece, kind of. So this is a rescue beacon, and this is the this is a research team that's been stuck down here. <laughs> and two people wanted to do the mean option. Two people wanted to do the or the dark side option. Two people wanted to do the light side. However, the dark side won. Okay. Now we come through this center courtyard area. So yeah, the, the, he's got uh, Votal Crush. The people that you're seeing are kind of cult members, and um, the creatures are remnants of Sith alchemy. Um, basically, like Sith, Sith alchemy was used to make regular creatures more dangerous. You know, all, uh, the brew poisons, you know, all kinds of different things. We don't have to fight everything out here, but we do have to fight some of these guys. I 
pulled a little too much threat there. I was starting to get my health taken down rather quickly. The sniper doesn't wear very heavy armor, so if I start getting targeted, my health deteriorates rather quickly. We got a couple more people that will move. That's a shield that I can put up, and were people inside my shield? I don't know if it protects against melee attacks, I don't think it does, um, but it, it it's damage reduction uh, for, I think for ranged, it might, might just be for ranged attacks. It's got a pretty decent area of effect to it, though. Okay, we got a, a group of enemies here. Weaker enemies out first. Need to work on the stronger guys. Stump him a little bit. Okay. Wonder if we got into a little bit of. Wonder if we might have gotten into a little bit of a rhythm here. Um. Sometimes it just takes a little bit for the team to come together. Uh, what? Oh, I did not know that you could go around the side here. I'm probably going to screw this up. Yeah, I don't know. I did not know that you could go around the side like that. see him to target him. Snipers can take those guys down kind of quickly, but we are going so far into the tomb here that <laughs> Yeah, 
that's just a ballistic shield. I think that just provides protection against uh, ranged attacks. never actually pulled the Beast of Odal Crush down into the room like that, or down so far into the tunnels. I didn't know you, I mean, I knew you could pull them kind of inside, but I didn't know you could get them that far in. We got a couple of tricky rooms to get through at this point. And it might have it may actually have been easier. Sometimes you don't have to fight these guys, but it, because we have a distinct lack of stealth, it may have actually been easier for us to actually just fight one or two of these guys. Um this whole room that we that he came that this temple guardian came running out of is full of of enemies just like him, which are very strong. They're they're elites. They're the they're pr they're pr pretty strong enemies. You know they they have the ability to do a lot of damage, and they're they're basically damage sponges themselves. Like there's two of them here, and we gotta we gotta fight one of them. Has been waiting for you. Oh, he's they're actually higher than elites. These are these are champions. last cultist that we have to fight and now we are on to so this is Vodal's tomb So this was his place of power. He, you are nothing here. he stealths every couple of minutes and creates these balls of living fire that chase down the person who has done the most, or has the most um, threat, threat, aggro, whatever you want to call it. Um, and they, they basically either just have to avoid them or... I don't want to get too close because I don't want to set myself on fire. <laughs> and there, he does... I don't know what that ability is, but that's this is the second time today that I've run this flashpoint. And both times I've been hit with that. It's basically like a one-shot kill, and I don't know what this it is. Place of power. You are nothing the, the Prophet of Vodal isn't the most difficult boss to fight. So these guys can probably take him down on their own. I just feel really bad that I that I you know once again am not contributing to the team. I I, I don't know what happened. I did not see how you know what ability that was that he hit me with that ki that killed me in one shot. Yeah, I did not see how that how I how I got defeated there, but. <laughs> All right, so that was the um, 
that was Aethys. Uh, the and and the, the the tomb of Vodal Crush. We are on our way back to the Sith fleet. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and drop out of the group. That way we don't, you know, we don't affect anybody else's. Uh, this is the space dock to Darth Malgus. I have the artifacts of Vodal Crash. Then you possess all that remains of the Dark Lord. Whatever happened down there will not repeat itself. My augurs felt the fine destruction of Vodal's spirit. The beings I fought in Vodal's sanctum, his servants, what were they? Vodal was an alchemist who filled a city with his slaves. It seems their evolution continued in the ruins, and their devotion never faded. As to the artifacts, the Dark Council will choose whether to destroy Vodal's work. I would see his name wiped from our history. There is no place for Sith Lords who place themselves above the Empire, not among the living or the dead. Arrogance is never lacking in men of ambition, living or dead. So we keep watch. We are done for now. Rest, and know you have done the Emperor's will. Okay, so that was the final bit of Aethys there. Uh, oh, I got some new, some new boots. Some funky knee pads. Getting good. A new earpiece. And a new belt. All of these are just going to increase my the the damage that I deal. They're going to increase the, the slightly better armor, you know. So I'll be able to I'll I'll be a little bit more resilient. I will never be very resilient. I'm still always going to be a bit on the squishy side. Um, I'm I'm thinking that like to go along with these boots um, when I get when I get the equipment, it's probably going to be like one of the, uh, it's pro I'm probably going to get a trench coat. I accept all forms of currency. Which would be kind of cool. So I can sell that. I can sell that. 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 And that. Thank you for your patronage. Repaired all my stuff. Finished the, uh, finished the flashpoint. Got credit for the flashpoint. Um, and that's where I am going to leave it today. So let's go ahead and log out. All right. Well, I know my uh, I know my commentary was a little a, a little rambling at, at points there. Um, you know, but that was that was the that was the Aethys flashpoint on the uh, and I think you can I think you actually do a slightly different variant of it on the Republic side. I may be wrong. Um, but that was the Aethys Flashpoint for uh, Run With My Imperial Sniper. Um, again, you know, basically just fighting off a bunch of cultists and uh, mutated mutated monsters. Um, but if you like the video, guys, go ahead and drop a like on it for me. Comments are always welcome. Subscribe if you want. And until next time, everybody, may the Force be with you.